Warning! Not for the easily offended or the pussy hearted. You have been warned. You just oh, went back to. <laughs> <laughs> You're telling me you yeah. woke up from death and what you did in front of everybody was just laugh <laughs> like. <laughs> Oh yeah. man, I would love to die and come back and do that, dude. That's great. How long are we gonna let white people get away with saying the word vinegar? <laughs> Cuban people, I'm Cuban. Cubans uh, will give you a big face based on the one thing you absolutely hate about yourself. So my parents had a friend growing up that I still don't know his name. I just know that they called him Coral Lucid. Which all the people that laugh are Spanish. So when the green goes in here, I'll tell you what that means. It means sweet butt. And he wasn't even gay, it was because he had memory surgery. Baby out of the paper and I called it. Holy shit, it's the actual escape! <laughs> Alright, see, because I fucking hate dating apps. You gotta meet people a little fashion way. Bars, barbecues, church functions. That's how I met my significant other in church function. I'm full of shit, her sister sucked my dick. And they're both really good at their craft. So I have a theory that it's genetics, I hope. And that means I have to do the unthinkable. And let the mom do her thing. And if the mom's not that good. I'm just not ready to have a beard on my ball sack yet. <laughs> this is a PSA to all the women out there. A period has never stopped anything but a sentence. So fuck your shark week. Come here, my little Heinz bottle. I'm going to please you in 57 different varieties. What the fuck is up, Tampa Bay? Ah! Not only have I taken over this fucking douchebags podcast. I kicked him the fuck out of my bank, too. <laughs> He's a piece of shit. I was peeing next to this funny guy at work the other day. It made me angry. I'm a looker. <laughs> that doesn't mean I'm gay, but it does mean I like to look over the stall and see what you're working with, daddy. I'm just out of curiosity. Scotty cheated that Scotty one. Chi, thank you. I shoved a banana up my ass. C-U-N-T, C word. I lost. And I got suspended, because the judge was a cunt. What was your favorite movie of mine? Did you recall any movies I did that you liked? Manny's doing something. No, I see. I'm. I. I just started in this new show called The Boys. Hasn't come out yet. My character's so... called Translucent, so you can't see. Me. Is it? Isn't The Boys about those gay superheroes? It's so good. <laughs> They're not gay superheroes. They're, They're actually gay really superheroes. awesome degenerate superheroes. And it's quite honestly, speaking of the gay, best superhero show you'll ever see. Speaking of gay superheroes, look who we have coming in today as our special guest. If his fucking Thing will load. I hear the music that back thing? there. I mean, I hear you the like music that, back dude. There. I'm playing that for the gay guy you guys were introducing. Yeah, <laughs> he's coming. He's coming somewhere. <laughs> I wish it was on Manny. <laughs> skin flautist. Mayonnaise. <laughs> Beware what you wish for. Hey, no. EJ, where's your face? Hold on. I hear a cracker, but I don't see it. You hear a cracker? Oh, oh, yeah. want this cracker. Hey! <laughs> What's up, bitches? EJ Salter. Hey. 
Look, it's Paulie, and Paulie wants his cracker, okay? Cheers, no brand loyalty. Cheers. Uh, hey, you're drinking Patron. Blech, God, I'm going to barf. Dilly, uh, dilly. I, uh, I put a fat dent in the Don Julio 70. Um, What's up, bitches? The other night with the neighbors, so it's That's fall cool. back to the cheaper shit. Right now. <laughs> we 10 minutes in yet? Oh, no, we're... I don't know how many minutes we're in, but I think I think I think we're doing good. At least forty five okay. seconds. Yeah, at least forty five seconds. That's how, okay. So ten minutes. That's, like that's how long so I last. Ten minutes in. Okay, we're ten minutes in. Got it. I think we're well. Remember, the intro is like three and a half minutes, so I think it's like the first uh, <laughs> first minute. First minute. Yeah, I think we're good. I think. I don't know. Cheers. Yes. Cheers, so, everybody. Uh, yes. Oh, oh, Ricardo, you got you you brought you brought the vegetables. That's a lot so, of broccoli. I can't show how much I really have. It's not on here. <laughs> I'm coming to you live from my backyard with a bunch of beer and whiskey. You probably got plenty. <laughs> oh. So EJ, this is how it goes. You know, we just sit here and do nothing. There's, yeah, there's 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 no there's no premise of the show. No. It's, it's just us talking. Cool. The shit. Yeah, the shit. No, the we shit, do the have shit shit. we have we have one rule. This is the Gabagooligans podcast. You are not allowed to talk about the Sopranos. That's it. So okay. why was that a fucking rule? Fuck That's you, always been my joke. That's always been my joke about this whole podcast ever since <laughs> I gave all the fucking name. <laughs> You gave us the name. Oh, absolutely! I came up with it. Oh, here oh. It Check oh, the receipts. Here, here I came go. up with I it. I call you guys Fucker. the Glob of Hooligans. We got you, you know this show. We got this is a little bit too diverse. Fact, we got I know this for a fact because I culture. said this on stage when I was featuring at O one, and everyone here was like, "That's a great fucking day for a podcast. Yeah. We should use that for a podcast." And I went, "Okay." Wow, this, we, this we show's got- always been. We got a little Nikki too diverse for my life. Here said Nikki well, Six. She's like, yeah, the talk. band's mine, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> how are you not allowed to talk about The Sopranos? That was such a great fucking show. And if you actually watched it, then just say that you like it, and then get caught not watching it. You know. No, I love the show. It, I can't. I, <laughs> all these bits came out when I was watching it. So Gandolfini was a guy. Talked about it on stage probably the first like. Three months, and then I was like, "All right, everyone's tired of hearing about this." <laughs> well, you know, they said Pussy was actually based on a true character. Yeah, 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 yeah. and then you know, there's another guy that started talking about it, so everyone got tired. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you could go for like all those movies for like the mob and shit back in the day. There was some damn good fucking movies like Casino, Goodfellas. Oh, yeah. well, fuck yeah. you know, basically anything Departed. Scorsese touches. <laughs> I love yeah. Except- the Departed. Except for the oh, Irishman, dude, that's like top ten. Has to be Irishman. Sucks. Irishman, 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 Irishman sucks. I, I never watched the Irishman. Oh, that's not it, how it, it was way too dude. long. It was, it was four, more... like three, four hours of bullshit, and the worst down CGI, like down age I've ever seen. Like they had Robert De Niro as a very rough looking fucking teenager. <laughs> dude, yeah. his, his fucking kicks but that his he was body doing size, was his body so size shit. was the same. <laughs> you got the it's like a teen- <laughs> well, you gotta remember, you know, teenage- pe- people back well, in the day looked old already, even when they were like 15 years no, old. Not like no. this. This was a teenage no, face. Dude, he's what, With- 76? Eight- he's like, he's a 80s now. He's like of- in his fucking 80s now. God was damn it. This was a te- it was a teenage face with a fucking 80 year old's body. I mean, it- yes. That sucks. <laughs> this, was, this was worse than Benjamin Button's. I thought it was a great take, though, on how Hoffa was actually killed. Robert De Niro, hey, yeah, he just turned 80. Lie. He just turned 80 back in August. So this is how I felt about that movie. Could have been an email. <laughs> 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 Man, he's like, I sat there for three fucking hours. Fuck you. So three and a note. half. Cliff notes, bitch. <laughs> I mean, did, did y'all see the newest Dune movie that came out? No, I don't waste my time. My whole bullshit. take on the Dune movie was... That oh, was shit. a cool three and a half hour trailer for the real movie coming out. I didn't even <laughs> like the first one. They were drinking spit coffee. Yeah. That's the one with the or rock two rock and a half hour movie, whatever. It was not good. 
I am um, real quick. Speaking of Dune with the Rock, how shitty of it is him to stand in Hawaii with Oprah and ask people for money? <laughs> We were talking about it. Doom with the Rock. <laughs> we're, we're, we're worth Wait, a Rock? combined one and a half billion. Could you help us pay for this? One and a half billion? <laughs> They're worth way more than that, dude. Uh, the, you know, the, I don't know anything. The, the Rock was <laughs> in <laughs> Doom? <laughs> the, no, Rock, the Rock he's was talking Doom? about He's talking about Doom. The fucking oh, shit, yeah. shitty <laughs> video game uh, movie. Yeah, they Doom. Should, oh, okay. and, uh, Doom. Maybe where they had like about a the good five one. minute first person but yeah, yeah, I'm talking about sand drugs <laughs> with worms. Sand with, the drugs. Vo- with that voice sand that dude's with got. Worms. <laughs> that fucking voice oh. he's got. Opioids, okay. <laughs> Opioids. Don't talk about those. <laughs> that <don't> spice. <laughs> that shit like toward the county up. I will not freebase cocaine. No, I will do some too. <laughs> 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 Dip a cigarette in a bag from time to time, but you know, dude, I got to meet Bucky Lassick, and I've told everybody like a thousand times. <laughs> if it's, it's white, fucking... do a line. If it's brown, snort it down. No, shoot them both. Ah, damn. Did you and Bucky Lassick play? <laughs> play <laughs> uh... it's like as an experienced heroin addict, can you shoot it down. <laughs> do you guys skate? Do you, Don't waste you guys the time. Suck together? them both up. No, dude, it was just pretty sick because like I never thought I'd meet that dude in life. And I used That's to play dope, as him bro. like in Tony Hawk Pro Skater. That was those that was games. that dude in the first one. And mm-hmm. then like we were just saying like sushi Rodney after the improv. And he was just dude, Rodney Mullen's a legend too, but he was just sitting there eating sushi after the uh the Pro AM fucking tour they did at Spot. I always oh, like oh, shit. I always liked Bob Burns. Spot's blowing up, man. Bro, Mike Valley. Mike, Mike, Mike V is fucking, yeah, he, he was a good scary too. <laughs> Badass flighter. He scares the shit out of me. Ooh. <laughs> Give me that fucking up. My favorite skater? Custom character in Tony Hawk's Skater character. Underground. Yeah. <laughs> the <laughs> real <laughs> black one. That fucking, that rivalry you had with Cracker fucking Jack over there. Yeah. With, on Bam's team, the, the, the little uh, wheelchair <laughs> boy. <laughs> you want to a list, boys? <laughs> Oh, fuck your oh man, poor Bam. Yeah, dude, he's twacked. <laughs> R.I.P. Like, oh, fuck Steve, fuck Steve-o. God damn, God, Tremaine. Dude. I I I just did fucking meth once, and I can't go on set anymore, man. There's actually a very interesting thing about how he's doing. He was doing very well for a long time. His wife was throwing these parties, and she was throwing herself through the crowd like. Dressed like going to the beach, like she was living that life still while he's trying to stay clean. Yeah, but that's Come because she wife? can't. No, Bam, yeah, Bam's up. wife can't stop partying even though Bam wanted to. So he fucking up and went to Spain for like six months. Poor Lived man, in a dude. shitty like studio apartment and just skated every day. It's but typical that a female ruins your life for a little bit. Yeah, he got away from his life for a little bit because, like, his family is 100% trying to control his brand because of all the royalties he still gets. Yeah. Oh, he probably got fucked over so bad on paper, too. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. And he's still oh, worth a lot a of kid? money, and they still oh, has money and I in. think I think his parents own uh, Castle Bam because they use it as, like, an Airbnb now, and they basically mm-hmm. are using all the money that they would with reservations and shit. Well, it was their house to begin with, wasn't it? No, it was his because nope. he. Uh, they got uh, hearing that was CKY and um, Jack uh, Jackass money. I can't yeah, feel dude, sorry CKY for the guy. He's addicted to his buddy's asses. So I mean, like, that's. <laughs> I mean, I mean, that's don't don't EJ, better. don't you want that though? Don't you want dicks in your ass too, man? No, nah, yeah. I know I got a fat ass, but it's not meant for that. Dude, you got a. You better never do. Time. You got that ass a donk, eat. boy. You got a nice little tushy there, boy. You are on un- name of the episode. EJ is blessed. <laughs> <laughs> well, that well that was the name of the you, that was your episode, Manny's. Episode. I know. It's the callback. No, or EJ about, is un- EJ is unnecessarily blessed. How about how about this? How about this? EJ's boy pussy. Uh, I got I got this I got this. Uh, the name of the episode is. The first Latino booty we've had on the Gabagooligans. 
Like, First Latina man, booty we Latina had in the booty. Gabagool against you. Yeah. I gotta get a little more wine, <laughs> like, real. You quick. have Latina booty as part of the ca- cast. Yeah, get some wine, yeah, yeah. Rick. Not like Damn. yours. Not Maybe like yours. You're saying I'm more of a wetback than you, bro. The back part, <laughs> emphasis. <laughs> emphasis on the back. <laughs> emphasis on the back. <laughs> you can't even Mega say he's a wet back because that booty's so big it stays out of the water. No, 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 no. His back is so. <laughs> He's got so much back, he makes the boys wet. Bro, so uh, somebody that I play Call of Duty with. Uh, Was that intentional? Oh, <laughs> oh, my God. God. <laughs> <laughs> There's a copyright the check. <laughs> We're live, by the way, bro. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hi. Hi. Hello. Well, our first <laughs> last guest, EJ Salter, everybody. <laughs> dude, you got some pink balls, man. <laughs> you got some gobble ghoul balls. balls, literally. You look like Captain Cola. Like inside of a rabbit's ear. <laughs> The fucking turkey neck, baby. <laughs> Why did Jesus you sit high so low? <laughs> did you ever wear drawers? Do you put nair on your you nuts have, too, man? You have grandpa balls. <laughs> did you shave them or did you shave them? Yeah, dude, those are like the fake Johnny Knoxville old man balls from the Jackass movie. <laughs> They're so perfectly <laughs> symmetrical. <laughs> yeah, that's the other weird part. They're like amazingly evenly round. By the Immaculate. Little. They're immaculate. Like, like one ball is not bigger than the other ball. They're both the no, same size. And they don't it's amazing. Hang though. different lengths. They're both on <laughs> equal terms. It was so hypnotizing. Lever scale. <laughs> Bro, they're on the same level. <laughs> All right, new you new can new episode. use that to level a house, bro. All right, new episode name: Ricky's Balls. <laughs> oh God, dude. I don't care. Holy what shit! Do I to lose. Man, give, no, give, your you tug. A, yeah, give your balls a tug. One hundred percent. Yeah, give your balls a tug, tip fucker. Give your balls a tug, tip fucker. Now we're just. Remember last week we talked about putting an entire blur on Manny's face for the first ten minutes. Mm-hmm. Now there's just going to be a random blur on Russo's. <laughs> Yeah, unfortunately, it's going to have to happen. I don't want it to happen, though, but, you know. I mean, we can't edit that out. That's a crucial part of the episode. Oh, no. I don't know. I love that Scotty's going to sit there and look at his balls as he edits a blur (laughs) for at least a good 10 minutes. Because, like, we just got full frontal for, like, 20 seconds, maybe, tops. You're going to get easily 10 minutes with that bad boy. Oh, yeah. (laughs) You should take... Anthony, take your hat, hat off, show your head, and then edit in his head over his <laughs> I'll send you a picture after the show to you. <laughs> Dude, like in fucking Men in Black, put them on someone's chin so they're the Balchinians. So, I was just about to say, do an Easter egg. Like, when I lift it up and you so- show my ass, his balls pop up. Like, or wait, wait, wait. <laughs> do this, do this, do this. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> What the fuck is that? <laughs> Dude, what is that? It's my underbelly. <laughs> all right, all right, EJ. Which podcast is better, this one or off the set? <laughs> Girl, who are you asking? I don't think there's been but one episode of off the set. I would definitely have to say this. <laughs> well, can't really compare. We didn't get on it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I'm... got... No, I got on it. I just can't do it. I wonder how you got on it. Total accumulation. There's like five and a half hours of wasted time. No. No, it's more than you got other episodes. What were you I did three I did I did three hours with that motherfucker on the first episode. What'd you guys talk about? Like Well, it I'll tell you this. Here's what we talked about. We talked about a lot of different stuff. And even Mm. though he's very autistically robotic, he's a good interviewer. But okay. he definitely uh, didn't. He's autistically he, robotic. <laughs> he, he didn't. But the interview and the length of time and the amount of resets and everything, it didn't do anything to ease the sexual tension between the back of my throat and the barrel of my gun. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I'm willing to say it made the tension palpable. 
you can cut it with a butter knife. I feel bad. I'm not gonna be able to make it with you on set on Saturday. But and with that being said, I agreed to try it again on Saturday just this... because. <sighs> Just, I feel okay. for the kid. Just, just, just don't, oh, just, just don't kill yourself, please. Do not. I just found it odd. I found it odd that there was like a uh, if you listen to this. Sorry, Justin. Just take this as criticism. I just find it odd that there's a whole <laughs> there's a whole skit planned out in the beginning with video editing and freezing and yeah, little preparations. Just just Bro, get that I shit, man. Lying. Just great. Get right into the get right into the episode. Just start talking about the people. Yep, who you're there to interview. That's what matters most. Exactly, not, not, not what you want to do. Exactly, I, I, they want to talk I have a cons- about. Yeah. I have a conspiracy theory. <laughs> the only reason why he wanted to do is because he wanted an actual reason to get dominated by Nicole Raven without having to pay for it. Yeah, I think he just wanted well, to hang out with us, there. and his excuse is he does he he doesn't know how to record episodes. <laughs> just say you want to hang out. No, I said to Ryan, I was like, I mean, I'm gonna say no, but yeah. What are you saying, EJ? I said to Ryan, you, you guys know I love Ryan. I was yeah, like, why the fuck do. would you make yourself Jesus coming back? You would have had the perfect setup, just popping up as a leprechaun out of a pot of gold, and he captures you to do an interview with you. you or, know? or if he took his wiener, like Jesus, bro, you're bald as fuck. Or if he took his wiener, Stewie, 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 or Stewie, Stewie Griffin, all grown up. Where's he now? Or if he tucked his wiener behind his legs and was Buck Angel, as well too. <laughs> oh. oh, I understood I that, that reference. Yes, I understood Here's that YouTube. reference. Cheers! Hey. Now Good I've already, job, no, I, I've already, I've already clarified that at, at title a couple weeks ago when I called I Buck would Angel. Not I, I, Buck. all I hear, fuck, I, I, when I said that, I just saw fucking EJ yes. Tony. And fucking LJ fucking lose it. What is it? Is that you as Jesus? <laughs> yeah. Yep. Nice. <laughs> now, here's Jesus. the fucked up part. Me and LJ were sitting there talking about it after you said that. Yeah. And it was what was more fucked up? The fact that he called Ryan Buck Angel or the fact that we're over here dying laughing because we know who <laughs> Buck <laughs> Angel is. <laughs> oh, God damn. <laughs> For real. It's, well, it's, it's so <laughs> good. It's so good. It's brilliant. When you find out about it, you have to look it up and it's, yeah, it's like unbelievable. Yeah, I want to get back on that podcast though, just so we can make an episode, have some fun, and I want to see how Jeremy does. What if yeah. what if we all went on it and just over really? and just and just overtook it? <laughs> like a pirate <laughs> ship. <laughs> you know I'm a Bucks fan, baby. Let's this is, do a, it. This is a podcast mutiny, motherfucker. <laughs> oh no, because you know exactly what would happen. He would title it fucking off the set with the No, it's off the set X Gabagooligans. It's gonna be a big crossover episode. And, and there's gonna be some sort of cute we cute editing in the beginning. Made. Yeah, we're all gonna, gonna be so yeah, there's, there's gonna sketch. be some editing editing in the beginning where we're all popping. Rick's at the wrong balls. times, we disappear again. And the other group pops up. That does, that group disappears. The other group pops up. Then we all ah. pop up at the same time. Oh, hey, we're here. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. hey, we're not on a tangent. Hey, we made it. We're here, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, so, it's cute. Yeah. It's good, but like, I think um, like, I, I think podcast. I have an idea for what I want to do. You missed Rick's with... balls. <laughs> <laughs> I have an idea. Don't tempt them. What I, I, I think I know what I'm going to do with this skit that I have to do. Hey, Janet. Hey. So you know how he makes everybody do one of those retarded I, fucking skits before his podcast? Yeah, of course. Who's, who's yeah, and I'm, just, I'm, I'm not a yeah. fan of those. Is this that you're talking? I'm, Wait, I'm just. Talking just about? I'm, I'm going to have him recreate shot for shot the That's intro the for The Sopranos. <laughs> But just use that song where he goes, Gabba Gabba Goo. Gabba Gabba Goo. Oh, fuck. Woke oh. up this morning and got myself okay. some Gabba Goo. Am I crazy or is that theme song for Sopranos? Does it not sound like Rob Zombie oh, making church God. music? Ooh. Now that's a, that's a good morning. point. Got it sounds like Rob Zombie making church music, baby. 
I'd like to. Make I would. I would want that hot, hot ass wife of his. No, I would want has a uh, choir. Sherry Moon <laughs> Zombie D. I thought we were talking I about Ryan. If anybody was going to spit it out first, it was either going to be Anthony or you, bro. Dude, I jerk off too much to not know <laughs> He's who like, that is. I've came to Sherry Moon so many times, but oh. my right hand is jealous. Wait, Buck Angel. Same. <laughs> Sherry Moon has been a victim of my adolescence many times. Used to. Hey, babe, can you bring me some ice, please? Damn. What, meth or... uh... Let's see if that works with my wife. Hey, babe. Yes, meth. That's how my teeth count Can you bring me stuff? Amphetamines. Ooh. Maybe it's amphetamines. Maybe Maybe it's Maybelline. Oh, on the record, it's not. Maybe methamphetamine. (laughs) No. Ooh. So, EJ, Tony, quick question for you, because I don't think I've ever actually asked you this question in all the time I've known you. Are you fucking gay? (laughs) Are you gay? He's only 20 percent. Okay. What is 20 (laughs) percent outside of me doing stand up? What made you want to do stand up, actually? You know, I've been an entertainer my whole fucking life. Like, You remember when you met me at the bar? What was I doing? Had a bunch of people laughing, freaking cutting up. Um, out of everything that I've ever done in my life, the purest joy I've ever gotten, my natural high, if you will, has always been ejaculation. Laugh. Ejaculation. Huh? And that's why it's your name. I miss what you said. Is bro. EJ short sure for ejaculator? Going to a clan rally. Yeah, ear job, ejaculated, <laughs> Normus Johnson, Enormous egregious Johnson. jerk. Take your pick. <laughs> egregious Johnson. jerk. Plan you can around. call me anything you want. It's not late for supper. I'm fat on the inside. Elephant. That's Jack. what happens with the amount of food I eat. It all goes right to my ass. But no, Elephant that makes Jack. sense though. Yeah, like Squidward. Like He's legitimately, no, like knowing EJ for as long yeah, as I've known him, that answer know. actually makes sense. Yeah, how long has known each other for? Twelve Fuck. years. Too long. Twelve years. Yeah. No shit. Can you take a couple. <laughs> yeah, like I want to say like 2008 to 2010 around there. Ever. No, you made me when I turned 21. Yeah, Anthony, so I, I thought you were sort of, I thought you moved to Florida like in 2013 or something like that. Or 2000, like, 2010. Was it 2010? 2010. Oh, yeah. shit. Mm. When I was on pills. Ooh. When I was running away from pills. <laughs> I was on pills. <laughs> I, was a, Maybe. I was a senior in high school. I was a fuck up in life. Yeah, I was a freshman college snorting. Anybody, most people are a fuck up in their life when they're 21. That, that, yeah. those words that he said. What did Rick just say? No one listens to me when I talk because I'm the a real Sicilian on here, so they treat me like the black guy. Well, you got to show your balls yeah, again yeah. in order, in order for us. <laughs> you know this guy, Ricky Russo, got a 16 inch dick. The, the cocksucker. That All fuck. balls. Oh. He calls his cock the cold cut. Wait, so what, what was it he said that Manny was pointing out that, what he said? Something about snorting stuff. Sorry, I was eating a peanut butter sandwich. <laughs> My wife made it. No, how... Um... Now, put some peanut butter on your balls. Bro, what do you think my dog's doing down there? I fi- I, the wonder, I figured. Dirty bitch. She better Story. Be balls are still though. out. <laughs> Most Story. people at the age of 21 are fuck-ups in their life, you know? And you take the majority of the population. Snorting Story. a ton of fucking oxy in 2010 is what I said. And Manny was like, yeah, that part, because he was too. I was drinking, smoking, and fucking anything that would fucking wink twice. Yeah. And and Zannies. Those were oh, Ooh, those dude, dude, I didn't remember shit, but I had some. Dude, Bane stuff. and I lived together at that time. <laughs> 2010, that I was doing. Was like a fucking, like roofing yourself. Yeah. Yeah, when I was oh, listening, when I was listening to your podcast <laughs> with uh with Sickler, I was like, hey, I wasn't can... it just great? It Let me brag about it for a second. It was good. But I was no... on a podcast with Ryan Sickler, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm probably brag right. over. No, no, it, no, because what I was saying was, uh, yeah, because you guys talk about spice a lot. I'm like, oh god, spice, good times. Yeah. yeah, it was a it was a big part of my story. Yeah, yeah. dude, Oof. I bought Oof. spice one time. And I opened it up, and it looked like dryer lint, and I got afraid and threw it out. It was uh, Damiana root. Smart. I did like Mad Make Hatter. Make and shit with that. I did like Mad Hatter, and uh, yeah, it was, it was bad. I did a lot of Red Magic, Blue Magic, Mad Hatter, K2. K2, yeah. 
Mr. Nice it Guy. Good. Mr. Mr. Nice, nice Guy. guy. Yeah. Mr. Yeah. Nice Mr. Guy. Spice Guy was a ripoff. Scooby Snacks. Mr. Nice so, Guy was different, bro. That yeah, so was... when they finally outlawed every single one of those compounds and just made spice completely illegal across the board. Yeah, man. In Tampa, there's a road called Benjamin Road mm-hmm. right in between Hillsborough and Waters. Yep. And it's right by Veterans. There were seven spice manufacturers on that road alone, and the FDA came and raided every single one of them at the exact same time. Good. Like, I mean, boots on the ground, every operation had the same communications, and they fucking boom. It was yeah, were, coordinated like a yeah. motherfucker. There were a lot were of people dying over millions there. Millions and millions and millions of dollars of like street worth were there being made. What are the yeah. odds that you and Rick ran into each other in one of these dens at one point? Just don't remember. He's like, hey. I honestly he, wouldn't be surprised. He saw his balls. He's like, hey, I thought I recognized you. Yeah. <laughs> Something about Man, the first time I met Rick. Message him after the podcast. Hey, something about the balls. first time I uh, something about the first time I met Rick, I just was like, I love this guy. We're at the ten. Everything mark, about man. him feels good, familiar. Yeah. I like it. Absolutely. Dude, the first time I, I, I met you was it. at New Faces, and you came on stage with energy. I was like, I fucking like Same. this dude. I, <laughs> like, I, anybody I met, else smell their no. hand after they jerk off? I'm like, I like this son bitch. <laughs> we talked, we talked on group chats and shit before New Faces. But that's where we actually yeah. met. Rick, I met him at Ornus One when he featured there. Yeah, he was fucking. Yeah, to me, he was killing it, but the crowd was sucking. He, he, he was just like, <laughs> man, fuck this crowd. I'm doing good. <laughs> oh, the, <laughs> the, the, the first time you, you were there, my first time. Yeah, I was there for your first time when he that's featured. Right. Yeah. Oh my god. How long ago was that? That was months ago. Oh, at least nine months. Yeah, months, that was a maybe. long time ago, man. Uh, Holy shit. I straight up told these fucking faggots. That was before me. <laughs> yeah. I said, fuck so, this Rick, crowd. Because I was like, what, three years? Who? You. You. I just say my life. Because fucking if out. I say a time, it, it's. <laughs> yeah, I think we've all been doing comedy our entire life, but when it came to, when it comes to like stand up and like doing professionally. Actually getting on stage. Yeah. Probably exactly. like a year and a half. Trying to funny on purpose with a microphone and nobody's talking back to you. It's a such a translation. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> That, that's not time. me though, man. Like my my shit is brand brand new. Yeah, that's good. I never used to try and be funny or nothing. Like I was just this. Oh, I was always a class clown, man. I, you I you come up with funny on purpose. Funny. You just always coping like mechanism. Fucking... <laughs> no, you you come up with really interesting. Like for example, ideas. The, why I chose. Come here, my little Heinz bottle. That was, dude, that fucking had me on the floor laughing my ass off. I was like, who just comes up? Who just calls a girl a Heinz bottle? So basically, no, it's <laughs> the <laughs> fairest. <laughs> it's the easiest fucking thing of all time how it happened. Yeah. I was in Walmart asking why I wasn't getting any pussy this week. I found out it was Shark Week. <laughs> we were literally in the condiment aisle. I saw a bottle of ketchup. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I cut that promo <laughs> in the truck with Kelly sitting in the passenger seat trying not to fucking die. She was in the passenger seat? She was in the fucking passenger seat. <laughs> oh, that's br- oh, that's brilliant, bro. That's fucking brilliant right there. Bro. Bro. I've met and- Miranda and I've met Kelly, but haven't met your two wives. And everybody's fucking met my wife. You've met my wife. I've met. New I met. Faces. I met Rick's. It's I've, the Puerto don't, Rican lady. I don't. I don't think yeah. I met Manny's. Oh, I thought we were going to balls have. again. Say hi, babe. You have. There. Hi, babe. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. uh, hi, <laughs> babe. <laughs> For twenty dollars, it's amazing. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, go, <laughs> go, hey, hey, go, tea bagger, right now on camera. No. Dude. Oh my God. No. <laughs> no balls. No. No balls. 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 No
Please elaborate. The Reagan sand goggles. What the fuck the is Reagan that? The Reagan sand goggles, according to <laughs> Urban Dictionary, <laughs> mm-hmm. the page is when a woman, where a woman is laying down on the couch with her head on the headrest. You walk up <laughs> to the headrest with your balls out of your zipper. You use your penis kind of like a crane mechanism to lift up the entire unit, at which point you gingerly <laughs> place your balls <laughs> over both of her eyes. Making the Arabian sand goggles. That's fucking hilarious. Dude, that's perfect. <clears throat> they should only be Arabian sand that's... goggles if you have like thick forest of black hair on your ball. Yeah, if you have like huge amounts of hair, yeah. <laughs> Osama bin Laden. Like the, the visual. Across her eyes. <laughs> hey, Owen. Can we get some American or, uh, Arabian sand goggles? <laughs> you, you just turn around like. You just have to Huh. Hi, man. Babe, my, <laughs> babe, babe, I heard your eyes are bad. Yeah. Just stop. <laughs> you fucking illegal you immigrants. Blackout curtains. I've got these Arabian <laughs> sand goggles. They work great. <laughs> now, let me ask you this. Have you ever heard of the angry dragon? Uh, oh, who has <laughs> Alabama hot pockets where it's at. Nah, angry dragon's great. So wait, 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 what's right, the Alabama? Tell them. Yeah. Okay, the angry dragon is when you nut in her mouth, and then you have to flip her around and shove it in her ass so she fucking screams and spits out your fucking cum. <laughs> fucking Christ. What's oh, an no, Alabama no, no. hot pocket? No, 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 no. Angry wait, dragon. Wait, wait, wait. Alabama hot pocket. Go ahead. Oh, Manny has a version, though. Manny has a version of the angry <laughs> dragon. Go ahead, Manny. Okay, so she's upside down in her bed, and she's sucking your dick like that. And then when you come, you hold it in there for a second so that it comes out of her nose, and then it splits four different ways down her face <laughs> like this. So she looks like a dragon. I was gonna say, I thought that was the Fu Manchu when like it comes. Yeah, out I thought that was the Fu Manchu. Like, no, she's she's angry, and she looks like a dragon. Short cake yeah. is even better. The angry pirate right. is when you jizz in her eye. And Stomp on her yeah. foot, so she's jumping around. My along, favorite, going Arr! The rusty pirate is like that, except you jab your thumb in her asshole, poke her in I'm the eye, kick her in the chin. No, I'm, I'm next. next. I'm no. next. No, me. No. I've been waiting to hear this Alabama hot pocket. Uh, uh, it's uh, Russo. Uh, all right. yeah. Alabama hot pocket. Go, Russo. Oh, that's just how when you're fucking her really good. She gets nice and wet. You turn around. You take a hot steamy shit in her pussy. The turd goes <laughs> in the pussy. Have you? Then, um, uh, uh, there, hang on, one more, one more. Go, one go more. Ahead, strawberry, yeah, yeah, yeah. strawberry, strawberry go shortcake. <laughs> strawberry shortcake. I love this one. I love this one. When you come in her face and she just doesn't expect you, punch that bitch right in the nose and she bleeds all in the cup. Strawberry shortcake. What? Uh, all right, my turn. Bill Cosby sweater. Bill Cosby sweater. <laughs> it's, it's 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 when it's when you. It's before it, when you're um, before you fuck her, you eat a bunch of fruity pebbles, and then when you're fucking her, you puke all over her, and it looks like a Cosby sweater. Yep. <laughs> and then you fuck her. Oh. So there's, there's two before the you most know the one. There's the penguin. <laughs> and that's when she gets your pants around your ankle and goes to blow you, and then she walks away, and you're like, eh, come back. <laughs> and the dolphin, it's the same situation where she gets her pants down and she turns and walks away, and you're like, eh. <laughs> you know the Houdini, right? What's huh? Houdini? It's when you, it's when you, you blindfold her and then switch out. No, no, you get her facing a window. I was just about to say Houdini from behind. Like yeah, from behind, from behind, and then you go. Hold on a second, got to readjust. You pop out. Your boy comes in. You leave. You go to the other side of that window and you wave at her. And he holds on and sees how long it takes for her him to get bucked off. It's also the rodeo. <laughs> hey, yeah. and then you tap on the window and you go, "What the fuck, you whore?" Hey, really quick, we have <laughs> we have two minutes. What we can do is oh, if we if, if we if we want to keep going, I can restart a new one and and, and okay. do another timer. Because I mean, we're still. We got a lot we're to talk hot. about. Yeah, we're hot as fuck. We have a lot so, to yeah. talk about. So we can we're wait for this timer to degrading sex positions. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we can do that, and then I'll just uh, invite you guys to another one, and then we'll continue. But we can still continue with the conversation right now. All these, we're all fucking pretty disgusting here. Oh yeah. Oh, well, I need to go find a bit. lighter. So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna end this one with my new superpower of invisibility, but I'm still listening. Okay. <laughs> Just don't come back with your balls. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go commit a felony. Oh, <clears throat> Ooh, go hit her, hit her again. <clears throat> no, 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 I'm gonna be a grown ass man holding a little boy's dick. 
<laughs> I like doing that at golf, especially when one of your buddies is pissing out at the uh by a tree and you yell in the fairway, hey, yeah, quit on. holding a little boy's dick. <laughs> yeah, oh no, what we do is we just start we just start hitting balls at each other. That too, yeah. If you want to die, <laughs> they just suck each other off. Yeah, Rick, you golf? What? You golf? I used to golf pretty frequently. We need a golf. I know. You know I, I know Anthony and EJ do. Manny doesn't. I, just, you know, I pawned nah, my club years ago. God, who said that? John Cena? Are you there? <laughs> oh, gentlemen, one, uh, those of you who like Star Cena. Wars. One Cena would, uh, would be happy to know my son chose a stormtrooper costume mm-hmm, for this mm-hmm. year. Dude, did you watch the OG. stormtrooper Bukaki? because his mom said no to the clan? No, <laughs> oh, that's, that's Dude, she didn't get any nut on her. Yeah. I'm gonna invite you guys in a bit very soon. The things, and so the Gabas would have to have ghouled again another week. For they were having technical difficulties. All you other creatures out there, good night and good hunting.